Okay, so I have some very interesting stuff to show you guys. So I was explaining to Jose a second ago, but the TTYD remake, we are so close to being able to run this game in 60 FPS. The problem is the game can't run in 60 FPS because the game's resolution is too high. I have a cheat turned on that lets me enable 60 FPS. So by pressing ZL and up on the D-pad, you'll notice that the game does run in 60 FPS, but it causes the game to slow down. And this is because the game is too demanding for the Switch to handle. So this is the game, technically this is the game running in 60 FPS, but it can't handle it. So the game just chugs and slows down. Strangely enough, the game actually works perfectly fine in the menus. The menus, you can actually make the menus 60 FPS, as you can see. So this is me scrolling through the menu at 60 FPS. This is me scrolling through the menus at 30 FPS. You can see it's a little choppier, right? <laughs> yeah, the PS2 handles 60 FPS fine. So yeah, I can actually I can actually make the menus 60 FPS, and that's the only thing I can make 60 FPS right now. So I'm jumping. This is 60 FPS, but slow down. And I press ZL down D-pad, and the game runs back to 30. Here's the interesting thing, though. I can't get footage for this, but I was running the game dock, or I was running the game handheld mode too. Straight. Interestingly enough, the game can run at 60 FPS in handheld mode, but not in docked mode. And I discovered that a few, like, like half an hour ago, basically. So if I were able to get this game and force the game to run in 720p, I could actually achieve 60 FPS for this game. But the problem is, I don't know how to actually force the game to be in 720p mode. So, that's the only problem. The game, can, it, it just can't, I can't lower the resolution of the game. If I could, I wouldn't mind playing the game at a slightly lower resolution just to enjoy 60 FPS, but... Sadly, um, we can't do that. So, yeah. I do have the faster text mod on, though. Lowering the res will allow me to run the game at 60 FPS, so the game will look smoother and run faster. Just at the cost of making the game look a little lower quality. So, yeah. Anyways, I'm gonna try Prince Mush a few more times. But trust me, the game does look great at 60 FPS. I would love to run it like that, but sadly I can't. Lowering the res does work, I confirmed it, because the Switch, when it's undocked, runs at 720 and the game ran at 60 FPS. I tried it, so if I was able to run it at a lower at a lower resolution, I could actually get 60 FPS. So I don't know. Here I am. I think I took my ensemble fires off. Uh, we'll see. I'm sure an emulator runs fine, though. There's a case where I actually wouldn't mind playing the game on emulator. Again, though, some things break on emulator, so it's not great. Spin jump or power bounce will be better. Do 13 there. Dang. <laughs> Plus, I also got to hear more of this awesome music.
Bingo time. Wow, I actually got the bingo. Oh yeah, someday I need to try out our PCSS3. That'd be cool. Ow. Well, you know what? We're gonna try something. Come on, you can now act it extra then. We're gonna try and use, um, Trial Stew. Ooh, nice animation, I gotta say. Alright, we're gonna use, um, the Choco Cake on Goombella. Okay, well... Let's try Power Bounce in Peril. Aw, oh, fuck. <laughs> He's going Super Saiyan. Yeah, I got it! Go away, Stage Hazard. Alright, I killed him. I got him. All it took was, uh, taking off an unsimple fire. Fuck you! Oh, so strong! You got me beat, Mario! Who could have seen this coming? You couldn't plan a more ferocious battle! Yes! Wild moves, raw power, flying fists of fury. What a beautiful destruction. This was out of doubt. Inarguably, definitely, absolutely, completely. An extreme battle of the highest caliber. But there could only be one winner this time. It was the great Gonzalez. <laughs> this will be a short stream. No, I won't. We're gonna do chapter 8. <laughs> We're doing chapter 8 today. I just wanted to get the fucking Prince Mush fight out of the way. Well, I finally beat him. Oh, that's right. I heard Mush. Oops. Make that Prince Mush. Has something to give you. I just saw him in the hallway if you want to catch him now. That's all. Take care, Gonzalez. Boo. He has something for me, huh? Now, what might that be? Mario, thank you so much for all that for that incredible match. We put on quite a show up there, didn't we? I know I gave everything I had. We should both be proud. I have a gift for you. Consider to thank you for being such a great opponent. Hope you'll take it. Yeah, Prince Mush's belt. A belt matching Prince Mush's and a sign of his friendship. I'm ready and willing for a rematch anytime. Not intend to win it. Well, uh, all it took was uh, Peril Strats to win it. Yeah, I want to finish chap. I want to actually do Chapter 8 today. It's gonna be a long one, though. Chapter 8 takes, like, four hours, I'm pretty sure. It's a long fucking chapter. But, we're done all the- we're- okay. So, we're done every chapter. We're done, uh, every tattle that I can at this point. We've done every recipe. I've gotten every badge I possibly can. I've read most of the stories. I think the only thing I can really do right now is talk to Wonky, I guess. You know what? I think I might do that, honestly. Let's talk to good old our good old pal, Wong. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and I hope you don't mind. I hope you don't mind me interrupting you. You can go back to your Xenosaga or whatever the hell you were doing. <laughs> I just wanted to show that we are super close to um, being able to play in 60 FPS. I know I keep repeating myself. <laughs> Yeah, let's go talk to Wonky, because I can do that. You're not going to play today? So you're taking a little break, I guess.
Alright, Wonky has some new tips for us. <laughs> Something you want to go ask a Wonky, right? If you pay me five coins, I can tell you about Zesty's sister. About that Zesty and her rogue horse, May Square. I've heard her sister's a really good cook as well. She married and met, she married and moved away a long time ago, but I'd love to try her cooking. And I suppose that's all I have to say. If you pay me five coins, I can tell you about the final tale. I heard this one from my old grandpa. It's a legend about one who will come to this town someday in the future. Oh, hang on. I did something weird with my Twitch. Okay, there we go. You're not forcing yourself to do anything since I finished the game. Oh, that's fair. And I should do the same when I finish this game. I should take a long break. Like a week break, maybe, from playing games. It's a legend about one who will come to this town someday in the future. He'll come when the sky grows dark again. Clothed in red and blue, the hero will bear seven stars and face the darkness. Oh, well, I guess they didn't fix that dialogue. <laughs> I don't know what that's supposed to mean, but red and blue seem like your kind of colors, am I right? And if the hero turned out to be you, well, I guess that'd be a bit much, eh? Well, wow. I'm a bit disappointed. They, had, they fixed the, um, the dialogue in Twilight Town. <coughs> <laughs> but they didn't fix that dialogue. Weird. If you pay me five coins, I suppose I could tell you about the cold place's secret. There's a pipe down here that leads to a very cold old place, Wonka hears. And if you jump in front of the tree to the far right of the area you come out in, then you get something nice, supposedly. But you won't catch y'all walking in a chilly place like that, no sir. He has more stuff. If you pay me five coins, I can tell you about Zest Dynamite. You know Zest T, right? She's a really good cook on Rogue Force Main Square. I mean, she has a rare recipe in her repertoire called Zest Dynamite. If you if Miss made with a coconut bomb and an egg bomb. By the way, an egg bomb is made from a fire flower and a mystic egg, and a coconut bomb is made from a fire flower and a coconut. And that's all I know, cause Zest lost the rest of the recipe somewhere. It was written down and she lost it. What a tragedy. I'm sure it'd be cool if she made it, though. I dro Yes, I dropped my drink. You can tell. If you pay me five coins, I suppose I could tell you about the strange ones. About Merlin on the east side of Rokeport and Mer Lovely on the ground. Oh, Wonka here is from a strange tribe of the names of people by profession. So, for example, if someone did the same work as Merlin, they'd have the same name. So there could be Merlins all over. Don't you find that strange? Wonky does. Oh, that explains why there's three different Merlins in this universe. That's all the stuff I know. I might learn some new stuff soon, so check back with Wonky. So he'll have stuff with post- he'll have stuff in post-game, probably. Dude, that makes so much sense why there's three different Merlins in this series. Because they're all different people. I'm surprised I never knew about that. Wonky has some fun stuff to tell you, though. Even though he's like, you know, kind of a weirdo. <laughs> Anyways, we're gonna finally go to the Thousand Year Door. Crazy ass music, man. I'm going in I'm going in this chapter with peril strats, it looks like. Okay, but I want better badges. Fire drive will be an exceptional badge to have. G after eight. The thousand year door. Damn, listen to this fucking music. See, yeah, this, this is some good shit. Ooh, how 
Chaos Shadow. Uh, this place is freaky. We don't have a choice, Mario. We gotta get in there and save Peach before this gets out of hand. Come on, Mario. Oh, yeah. This is the entrance to the Palace of Shadow. It's seen no visitors for a thousand years. It's so big, it kind of overwhelms you, doesn't it? I don't like the vibe from this place. Maybe it's just my nerves. Wow, look at that! That looks fucking awesome. The palace found behind the thousand year door in the ruins beneath Roadport. Wanna hear- sure, I'll hear something, it makes no sense. Well, this certainly looks like... Oh, there's a stopwatch there. This certainly looks like the Palace of Shadow. Well, there's no- there's no music in here. Or no battle music. That's a Swoopila, an airborne, blood-sucking, bat-like thing. As if losing HD wasn't bad enough, this little creep adds yours to its own. That's totally, totally gross. Don't let it bite me, Mario. The Switch emulator really runs better than the 3DS emulator. I know, isn't that weird? So, this, um, the Palace of Shadow does that thing. It does that thing where, like, it plays the dungeon music even inside the, um, even inside the dungeon, or in even inside battles, you know what I mean. I don't get why the 3DS it, emulator runs like shit. Also, I dropped some, I'm dropping frames. What the fuck? Uh-oh. Hold on. Actually, it'll be fine. Oof. I dropped some, I dropped some frames there, man. That, that's not good. I need to close, uh... Pegra. And some other things, maybe. Oh. It's because I... It's probably because I had fucking Twitch open. That's why. That might... That might be why. Okay. Is it, is it just me, or is the music kind of loud? No, that's just me. I think I have my game audio really, really loud. It's not- it's- it's Twitch lag. The recording is perfectly fine. But that is weird. Well, it might be because recently today... My brother is also on Ethernet now, so he might be eating up some of my internet. Possibly. Well, gonna need more BP to make up for that HP level up, mate. Mario becomes an A-list star! Mario's crowd and stage get even bigger. Yeah, we do. We finally made it to A-list star. That's pretty awesome. There's a shooting star down here. I I'm still got. I got 15. I gotta use some soon. What do you? What items would I even use though? Because, think, truth be told, I don't really need a lot of these items. I guess I could use the Love Pudding. I, I don't really want the Love Pudding in my inventory now. I'll tell these guys in the next battle. 
Nice green curtains. Oh, that's just a Mr. Softener. Okay, I don't want that. I don't want that. Okay, now we can tattle the dry bones. That's a dry bones. It's a former Koopa whose spirit animates its bones. Oh, that's so freaky. When it's he goes down to zero, it collapses into a pile, but it'll eventually rise again. By an explosion will put a permanent end to it getting back up, though. A dry bones will sometimes build as friends if it feels outnumbered. If you don't take them all out close together, they'll keep coming back. Let's light them out all at once and quick. These things are totally freaked me out. <laughs> I heard a boo in the audience. Heart attack is probably the best option here. I'm gonna be getting a lot of star points in here. Because I've been I've been avoiding a lot of encounters on purpose. Just to make the game just a little bit more challenging for myself. This late this lad throws stuff really far. Can you roll under the bombshell bills? No, that sucks. You can't, you can't, um... Ow! Oh, I forgot to put my Fem Pluses back on. Oh, shit. That's a bombshell, Bill. These things are completely shot out by bombshell Bill Blasters. His attack's high, but his HP is low, so take it out for it makes you, takes you out. Then again, if you focus on these guys, you'll never win. Smack that bombshell Bill Blaster. to put my fem pluses back on but what do i take off for the fem plus i guess i could take off uh, old at p put on another defend plus hmm i don't need pretty lucky that's for sure i might not need a flower saver p i don't know it's hard to say which i'd want to have on <laughs> flower finder well if i take off flower saver p i could put on flower finder and I can take a close call and put on the other defend plus. But. Ow. I missed. Oh, fuck. Well, that was a waste of a life shroom. And we're gonna need you to hit me again, by the way. Thank you. Perfect. I do. I, I killed these guys in one turn. That's a bombshell build blaster. Players' bombshell bills makes sense, right? It's really, really tough. Yeah, hard to hurt this guy. Thing is, if you don't take it out, it'll keep shooting bombshell bills at you. So you gotta figure out a way to beat it and fast. Well, I have a way. I'm not really feeling this remix so far, honestly. This room. Alright, here's all or nothing. Alright. Someone said that all or nothing got changed. 
Let me, let me see. Let me see. Let me try putting on all or nothing. I mean, I could take off power plus and put it on. Put on all or nothing. It says Mario's attacks remains boosted by one as long as action commands are being executed successfully. Failing an action command will drop to zero. How is that changed? I'm confused. Hmm. So I can put on another badge. Like, I don't know. I don't really know what I should put on. Close call, maybe? <laughs> I mean, I do want to be in danger. Right inside the Palace of Shadow. This is a corridor, I think. Don't let the enemies and traps distract you. Spike traps, huh? They can pop up anywhere. We'll just have to be slow and careful one step at a time. Do I remember the way through this place? I mean, it's kind of hard to tell with the Supulas in the way. I'm gonna level up in here a bunch. Ow. Fuck, man, I'm getting rocked. Okay, I'm not mistaken, I think you wanna go up here? Yeah. Also, I'm bringing the tattle. We're inside the Palace of Shadow. There's a large bridge over the lake here. Those fire bars in the middle are kind of a problem, huh? We better avoid them. If you're all sketched out trying to jump them, just use Vale's ability. Or Vivian's Veil ability. Fairy Prince Peach Bee, I'm worried. Let's hurry and find her. I gotta find- I gotta test something real quick. Does this still work? Yeah, it still works. Let's go. Ow. It's so weird hearing these uncompressed clips of Charles. Here, here, Phantom Ember. No! I'm pretty sure there's only one Phantom member in this loadout, that's why I wanted to make sure I tattle properly. That's a Phantom member. It's an angry spirit born of hatred and confusion. So I'm not too cool with this thing, but bleh. You'll take damage if you touch it, and something even worse will happen if you attack it with fire. Also, if it attacks you, you might catch on fire, so try to guard well. Let's send this ghoul back to the grave, okay? Please. I should be able to kill it with, with hammer. Yeah, 12 damage. If I'm not mistaken, I believe there's a item here as well. Well, there's a boo sheet there, but I didn't pick it up. Well, I might actually die in here. <laughs> I want that boo sheet, damn it. Those flames just keep coming up. Maybe we can roll under them or get out of them in some other way. Now, I could heal, which would be the smart thing to do, but peril strats are just much more fun. What a humongous room. I say it was pretty, but even this place feels pretty weird. It's like the whole place got a curse or something. Did you say duh to me? Where are Prince be? I'm worried. Those are some weird color bones. Very suspicious. But I feel like I've seen something like them before. I guess we're not gonna get much farther without checking them out, are we? Hmm. 
You want to even find any voice mods I could use? Uh, don't show me this again. Voice mods being really annoying today. <laughs> We have one called Kong. That's a new one. Hmm. Bruh, bruh. None shall pass by. Let those who disturb her sleep fall into the depths of endless darkness. Ah. May the intruder never find the key to this door. We just need to catch that one dark enemy. Try scattering the others with your hammer. Yeah. Ooh, spooky music. That's a dark bones. It's the baddest of the bones, gang. When his HE goes down to zero, it collapses into a pile, but it'll eventually rise again. Fire explosions will put a permanent end to it getting back up, though. His HE is high, so it's hard to take it down. Like any other bones, it sometimes builds friends if it feels outnumbered. Pretty tough enemy. You better take it and his buddies out all at once. Alright, let's see how much fire drive does. Ooh, wow. Some good damage. Okay, good. He's doing what I wanted him to do. Look at this fucking music. Dark Bones has his own boss theme now. It's fucking wild. That's giving me a level up. Alright, 54 BP, lads. Palace key. Look at that palace key. That looks really cool. Where your friends peach be? Oh, does the music in Palace of Shadow get better as you go along? I have 15 <laughs> items again. We're inside the Palace of Shadow. That's a long hole leading down from here. Kinda of feels like the Earth is slowly slowing us as we progress down. Yuck. Very good brain. Okay. Oh boy. This might be a time. Actually, no. We'll be fine. We just gotta. We just gotta jump on them. I still do a decent amount of damage. Guess we're rally winking. Mario's are such a powerhouse, dude. Yeah, the music's definitely getting better. I like it. <laughs> Screw off. I 
I do really love the shadow, the Palace of Shadow. That was really cool. Ooh. Although I could, it couldn't hurt to get hit by an enemy every now and then. Check this loadout out. I'm gonna get hit by one of these bombshell bills, by the way, so I can get into danger again. Or you could go for Goombella. Really, really good use of my time here. Fork! No, Merle, you're screwing me over, dude. Anyway, for Goombella, I mean, y'all, y'all, fuck you guys. You're, you're mid as hell. <laughs> no, piss off. Can't even get into danger, man, because the bombshit bills don't even want to go for me. Actually, we have one more shot at this. All right, last chance, guys. I'm giving you one more chance. One. Just fucking do it. Thank you. There we go. I love that the bullet bills can do that, though. They can just, like, shoot, like, really high up. One thing I find really cool compared to the bullet bills in the original 64. Okay, now they got fucking guitars in here and it's all good again. Oh, I love this room. We got a save block in here too. Alright, PFD down P. Mine. And you know what? Nice storm I too, I guess. But I need to get rid of something. Mm, get rid of the stopwatch. We're inside the Palace of Shadow. There doesn't seem anything special here. Still, it has the same gross feeling, even though it's so nice and spacious. Mario's gonna keep gritting onwards. We're inside the Palace of Shadow. Seems normal, but I bet there's a secret here. Definitely not really that spooky. <laughs> it's just like, yeah, fuck yeah, Palace of Shadow. Boonie. We love Boonie. I, I sent Jose made Boonie earlier. Wait, what? What the hell? There's no torch here? Oh. They're mixing it up. Holy shit. Dude, they make- they're mixing up this puzzle, what the fuck? Wait, what? Oh, okay. <laughs> Raisin replaced Sakuya. Yeah. Dude, they mixed up this puzzle, that's crazy. I actually like what they did with this. They made it less boring. Ooh, this area is always one of my favorites. We get out of one weird room just to find another one. It's huge. I mean, it's like an underground city, right? What is this place? 
this is a palace courtyard, but it feels so cold and icky, just like, it's like time stopped here. There's a suspicious tower across the water, but I want to study those open mouth statues first. Yeah, I wonder what Romilia's uh, reaction would be. Oh my god, they make change out noises. That's so cute. Ama that's amazing. Super guard the chain chomps, apparently. Vermilia loves maids. Mario Wonders is technically an SMB5. I mean, can't it just be its own thing at this point? <laughs> That's a chain chomp. I'd hate to get chomped by to death by those teeth. They look nasty. Its body's hard, so most attacks won't do much. Plus, you can't damage it with fire or ice attacks. Luckily, it has low HP, so you can take it down with a special move or an item. Chain Chops are, like, super pumped all the time. Don't they ever get tired? Mm. I suppose we could try using the, um, Shooting Star. If I could get a Super Guard... Well, there goes my last two life shrooms. So much for saving those for the boss. There's no difference. Can a Mar can't a Mario game be unique without being compared to New Super Mario Bros, though? That's like if I said, um, New Super Mario Bros is Super Mario Bros. 5. Or something. And New Super Mario Bros. Wii is Super Mario Bros. 6. <laughs> I, mean, I mean, it's sadly not wrong, but still. I feel like we should differentiate the Mario games. I like, so I like how when it comes to 2D Mario, we have... We have the original quadrilogy. We have the two Mario Land games. We have the Mario Advance uh, quadrilogy. And then we have the new Super Mario Bros. quad quintilogy, I guess, if you want to count Luigi U. Sounds like something happening again. Do you think I can reach the tower now? Well, I want to listen to this, this like, ambience. This is some good shit. There's the cursed elephant power up. Well, they're already playing this music. The Dark Wizards! Oh, I do eight damage. All right, Dark Wizard time. We finally got to see these guys in action. That's a dark wizard. It's a part machine, part organic centuries old thing. <laughs> Call it the Cody's mom power, sure. He uses magic to attack and to alter your conditions. Stay on guard. If there's only one left, it'll multiply itself to confuse you. I know they look totally goofy, but they're actually pretty tough enemies. Yeah, this fucking music's great. 
Wait a minute, do I still have my unsimplifiers on? Holy shit, I do. That means I beat Prince Mush with a one frame a super guard. Holy fuck. I guess I want PD on D up though. I just don't use the power bat or the partner badge as much. Grind up, grind up, grind it. Hmm. I could put on a sec. I could put on a flower saver P again. His rally link does cost a bit. I blame Nathaniel Bandy. Well, I might have to jump on one of these phantom members to get myself back into danger. Another ice storm. Good lord. How many of those do you need? I mean, otherwise I could put on quick change. If I can find the... I think I can find that. Hmm, but what would I want to take off for quick change? It's not... It's kind of a hard question. I could take off a PFD down and a double FM plus and put it on. No, I still don't have enough for it. Hmm... All right, quick change. Where are you at? Uh, oh, I don't need flower finder for this. Oh, I still have feeling fine pee on. Jeez, what was that doing on this whole time? Okay, now I can put on defend plus again. There you go. It's too late to last since I'm tired. <laughs> Oh, oh yeah, the fucking Nathaniel Bandy thumbnail, I remember that. Okay, so I'm gonna do something really stupid. There we go, big brain move. Remember the curse thumbnail he made, yeah. Hmm. Might need to heal up Goombella for this. What do I... I don't have a lot of FP items, though. That's the problem. I mostly have buffing stuff. That's about it. Spicy pasta and Anki pasta will be good. Alright, let's see how this goes. We're inside the Palace of Shadow. There doesn't seem to be any big puzzles here. The deeper in this palace we go, the more, in, more, the more I feel an icky, oppressive aura coming from its depths. Where do you think this leads? Guess we'll just keep going and find out. Alright, this is gonna. We got Gloomtail incoming. Who are you? No one disturbs me here in eons. Who dares defile this sacred place? Hey, isn't that Hooktail? We totally be here before. What's she doing back? What? You destroyed my precious younger sister? I wonder why she hadn't written recently. Quick and fear, mortals, for I am Gloomtail. I will avenge my sister by taking your lives and then gnawing on your bones. Alright, this is gonna be fucking hype. <laughs> my first fresh meat in ages. Allow me to take my time and toy with you a while. Halfly this fight. 
Or you gotta tattle them. That's Glimtail. I think he's Hooktail's brother. I see the family resemblance. Max HP is 80. Attack is 8. Defense is 2. He'll bite or stomp you, or he may even breathe poison on you. Great. When his HP gets low, he may throw in some other attacks as well. Wouldn't surprise me. Especially watch out for his Mega Breath move, because that move's gnarly. He also stores power from some attacks, so use Vivian to hide avoid those. Uh, you know what? Let's try Fire Drive. Evil Dino. Boom. Ow. Well, that's not a good start. Wait, wait, wait. I'm in peril, though. Well, that didn't go well. Actually, question. If I give Mario his turn back, does he die? We're about to find out. No, he doesn't. Right, you know what, then? We're gonna... We're gonna sweet treat. I got myself back at the five again. should be good. Alright, back in the danger. <laughs> you are tough meat, my little tasty morsels. But how will you fare against this? Always doing the ground pound. Oh, shit. That could have been really bad. That could have been, like, seriously bad. This is actually a bad- this is actually a pretty good strat. We're just gonna keep sweet using Sweet Treat. Get back up to five every time. You know, heal, FP, and stuff along the way. There we go. That should be good. Perfect. Perfect. I could probably kill him before he does Mega Breath. Although, to be honest, I kind of want to see it. <sighs> you are not the easy prey you appear to be. I would never be able to show my face again if I was bested by you, whelps. So I'll show you the true extent of my power. Yeah, I do not want to get hit by that, so... Yeah. Okay, well, what we'll do first... We're gonna use Vivian real quick. We're gonna see if I can get the Veil move to work. Mega Breath! Oh, dude, that looks fucking awesome! <laughs> Do you understand my true powers now? Dude, he, he did a fucking Kamehameha at me. I swear. I'm done. All I've done is sleep and listen to my favorite Toho. Favorite, for some reason, it's favorite Toho music. But you know what? I wouldn't judge you for doing that either. Hmm. How can this be? He's, he's gonna do it again? Okay. Well, in that case, let me just spin jump. Boom! No, no. Is it true? Can I expire? Woo! Yo, I got seven, seven, seven coins. You wish it was Toho music. Yeah, 
There's a little chest. Oh. Oh. We need Bobbery here. Let me tell you, treasure chest. Wonder what's inside. Let's check. Star stone. A strange star shape. So it actually looks more like a star. It's the tre. Oh yeah, very base. I wonder why we were supposed to use the star stone we found. Did we totally miss something earlier? Yeet. Wait, what? Whoa, they changed this room completely. They got rid of the ultra shroom and jam and jelly in here, and now it's a, like shittier items. Weird. Don't know why they did that. Weird change, but okay. <laughs> it's more than relaxing. Well, I, uh... I did a pretty good job at dealing with that. Honestly, Last Stand is just... It, it's what makes everything possible. <laughs> it's more sentimental. Hmm. I don't want to make sure I have Goombella out, just in case I get into an encounter. This is another corridor. Big surprise. Take it from me. If you ever feel lost, best thing to do is take a good, hard look at everything around you. Ooh, we're gonna get to do the, um... What's it, the what's it called? Ah. Watch out, Chain Chomp. This is another quarter. I wonder how long these things go on. I'm sure only all your special skills and those partners. Don't forget to use your strongest muscle, too. Your noggin. Heh. <laughs> Next bias music is Far Away Promise. I see you. Alright, so I decided to um make some tea instead of gain juice because I'm also hungry and tea technically uh the, the one with the music box. I think the ho music hose is talking. I think I've seen it. I don't know. Hard to say. I mean, you sent me a bunch of music, so I've probably heard something like that. The chain chomps back again. No, the chain chomps are gone. They piss off have to deal with them, okay. I want to say that tower across the moat. Think you can reach it with all your abilities, Mario? I'll give you an example. Sure. Alright guys, we're gonna do the Tower of Riddles next. We're already like halfway through this chapter. Maybe this chapter isn't as long as I thought. But then why was my finale really long? I'm confused. Can I look at the Book of Mario finale? Wasn't the Book of Mario finale like really fucking long? No, it was only- it was 3 hours and 37 minutes. Oh, you know what? I'm thinking of the Flavio run. The Flavio run's the one that took like six hours. Yeah. This chapter took me four hours in total. I think that's with the ending included though. Ooh, this area looks fucking nice. How could there be such a huge tower on the ground and why was it built? And why are there so many rooms? I love a good mystery, but this might be too many mysteries. This palace is so quiet. For now, let's use the stairs and see what's up there. Let me listen to this music real quick. Ugh. That is pretty nice, you're right. Oh, 
Oh, a completely different tone with this. Mario, look at that. It's totally huge. What is it, you think? Alright, Starstone. I find this part really beautiful, by the way. This part of the game was always really cool. Oh, they light up. That's really cool. How mysterious. Ooh. Let's see how let's see if they if they change these at all. Eight pillars on the third floor of keels in them. Guess we should be hunting for eight keys. You know, I had such a trouble such trouble fight figuring these out as a kid. What is this one? The stars up in the heavens shone. The shy one hides their shape. The shy one hides their face. Ooh. Sound like you have a mysterious chest sitting on open, Mario. Broken mirror, huh? There's something right on the wall. Something tells me it's related to the history of this tower. Tower P. I'm glad that you can hear the boo doo 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 part of the song still. Is this the one where you go through the wall? Straight on, straight onward, destroy what lies in your path. Yeet. All right, my tea uh, should be ready in like, I don't know, 10 minutes or so. Okay, good. They actually mark off which doors you've been in. I'm gonna need, uh... I'm gonna need this real quick. This is the one I think it is, the one with the dry bones. Yeah. Carrying the lore of the sky. Let fall the weakest, then build the strongest. Well, that's not doing what the... It's not doing that, though. Okay, build the strongest. Bonk. 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 I think I'm gonna, I might level up after this Dark Bones fight. Maybe. What? I didn't get a first strike? BS. At least, uh, you know, let's try power bounce. Never mind. Yeah, people, a lot of people have been saying power bounce is way harder in this game. He see lives. Okay. <laughs> you know, let me try one more time. I can't do power bounds for shit in this game. No, well, I have six star points, but but no FP, so I might have to heal anyways. Actually, I'll fight the chain chomps outside and get a little of that way. That'll be the way. I think I left that guy there, huh? Yeah. 
So you have this room. By skill and might engraved in stone, four stones, twin rooms, one is two, two are one. It's a metal block. No matter what you do, you can't break it. Seriously. How um how unfortunate the ultra hammer got weaker in between games. Since it can't break metal blocks anymore like it used to. I know one of these rooms you have to um, just walk through a wall and you find it. This might be the flurry room. Good thing I remember how to do these rooms. I love the star tech the stars. The stars are so cool. How they're like disappearing and reappearing. Feared far and wide across the land, the unseen may yet be felt, be it there. Be it here, be it there. Blurry's freaking out. Is this the one where you walk through the wall? Ooh, I love that effect. That's a really cool effect. Going through the wall like that. Oh, the end can go just go through the entire wall. Stone is arrive with the celestial spheres. All you see isn't all there to be. Touch it to pass through it. I do feel like they, um... I do feel like they change these up a bit. They feel maybe a little less cryptic, I guess? I don't know. I don't know you have to come back to these over and over. Master of Shadow? Let's go up here and get this door real quick. I do miss the, the sound effect of hitting the switch in the original. I mean, that's just gonna be one thing they can't really replicate. Oh, sorry, that was my, uh, my alarm. <laughs> I'll be right back again. Alright, we're doing pretty good in the Palace of Shadow so far in Riddle Tower. And I have my tea, finally! So that's exceptionally good. I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty tempting to go to just take a shower right now midstream. But... I might do that after, after I... You know, I got an idea. Since I'm kind of feeling like I'm in the mood for it, I might actually take a shower like midstream, to be honest. I'm just gonna do it once I get to like, I don't know, the boss or something. The seven hewn by fell hand, onward, 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 retreat, retreat. So I always assume that as a kid you have to do all seven other puzzles before you do that one, but that's not the case. It is kind of weird though, because in the original it says complete all seven, or whatever. I think it has more- I think set, the seven has more to do by like the crystal stars or something though. Something like that. 
Yeah, I don't know. You ever just have that feeling where you feel like really gross or whatever? And then you just like have to shower? That's what I'm feeling right now. Hmm. I don't really have an easy way to get my FP back. I mean, technically I do. And we're about to fight shadows or we're about to fight the shadow sirens soon. So yeah, this is gonna be a pretty big moment. Oh, oh. You can't see them there. Alright, let's go, um let's go we'll avoid the chain charm firstly. Oh, get away from me, Chain Chomp. Four. Thank God for a lucky day. Or pretty lucky. I could have been dead there, honestly. Or you know what? Fuck it. We have shooting stars. Let's use them. Broken mirror. Whatever the fuck, however the fuck that song goes. I'll take another level up. I'm getting a lot of level ups this time. Alright, 57 BP. I really don't need this much VP, but you know what? It's fun, man. It's fun, let me have it. Ooh. Three times the coins. I mean, now that I mean that's that makes sense that they could, they're doing three times the coins now. I'm gonna put on charge, and I'm gonna put on another PFD down. There we go. Cause I don't need this heart block anymore. Ooh. This fight, this fight's gonna be rough. You know what? I'm stupid. <laughs> I didn't even put the fucking keys in. You know what? I mean, it's fine. I got a level up. Nothing wrong with that. I was wondering why the shadow sirens weren't there. You know, it's kind of a shame that... The, uh, two remakes of my favorite games have changed names of some things that I don't really, I don't really like. Like, Clay Morton instead of Mac, and Mario RPG is a good example. And then Three Shadows instead of the Shadow Sirens. It's just a shame because it fucks up the wiki too. Because then the wiki just assumes it's called. You know. The wiki has to update its name so it doesn't have the cool name anymore. And so it'll say shit like, you know, The Shadows, originally known as The Shadow Sirens. It's like, nah, man, not originally known. Like, that's what they're always gonna be, man. Don't go listening to Nintendo's new BS. <laughs> you know what I mean? Same goes for all the other updates, shit like Claymorn and Spirit of it, you know. You get used to a name for like a couple decades, like a decade and a half in my case. And then they suddenly it goes and changes on you and your whole world comes crashing down. The stars up in the heavens shone, carrying the lore of the sky. Carrying seekers from on high. By skill and might graved as stone. Stones to rival the celestial spheres. The seven hoon by a fat, fell hand. Feared far and wide across the land. Master of shadow, queen of fear. That's, that's cool. I always loved how this fucking thing moved. It looks so cool. 
Wow, it's moving. Ooh. Oh, what? Yeah, check this shit out. That's some amazing cinematography there. What was that? What was that huge sound? Let's go check things out. Ooh, also... You can stand on these now. You can't do that in the original, that's cool. Ooh, I just realized, are the Shadow Sirens gonna have a second battle theme now? Like, they really don't need to go that far, but... The fact that they do is amazing. Alright, here we go. Now we're gonna fight the Shadow Sirens for real this time. The question is, like, can you see them from here? No, you you just straight up don't expect them. They really come out of nowhere. It's just the crazy part. What is that huge sound? Let's go check things out. Well, I got my badge set up, so I'm all happy. All right, here we go. We've been waiting for you, Mario. What, Professor Frankly? What are you doing here? Thank you so much for opening the door for us, Mario. Yes, that was nice. Thanks to your thanks to your go do good predictability, my plan is progressing very smoothly. Opening the door for you? What do you mean by that, you old you total hag? <laughs> you still don't see it? Ah, such fools. The professor, frankly, you were with when you opened the thousand year door was none other than this little freak in a sheep. Oh, my name's Duplus. <laughs> the real Frankly's probably still passed out, dreaming a little dream. Poor thing, once we get rid of you here, our plan will be nearly complete. Ready for the end, my dears? You and that traitor Vivian have a date with eternity. Uh -huh. That's right, Slick. Eternity. Shut up, freak. Okay, right. Sorry. Oh my god, is that his unused poison animation? Oh, it's the end, all right. But not for us, Beldum. You guys are going down. Come, my sort of lovelies. Marilyn, freak sheet. Uh. I said my name's Duplis. Let's go. All right, my kind of lovelies. This time we take out Marina's goon squad for good. So if I catch you slacking, you'll be in for incredible punishment come tomorrow. Go. Okay, 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 okay. So yeah, these guys are brand new. They have brand new tattles that we have to go through again. Ooh, look at him, he's angry. That's Duplis. He's a shapeshifter and he can even turn into you once, Mario. He may turn into one of us and attack. When he does, he'll have our abilities. Yeah, how do you think he became one of the three shadows? Isn't that weird? How do you think he stands Beldum's abuse? You think he's all right in the head? He probably likes it, to be honest. Wow. Reminds me of in Bo Book of Mario where he's like, want, 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 want. <laughs> Alright, plus four, plus three, not bad. Woo. Oh, she's charging. Oh, well, that fucking stinks. Alright, it's double dip time. 
You know what? What if I just Ice Storm you guys back? Yeah, I'm gonna Ice Storm you guys back. Take that. Oh, I froze Marilyn. That's pretty good. He's gonna scan... He's gonna scan me! And he's actually purple! Go it in remake. Um... Mar uh, Bell, let me, you didn't do anything. We need to get rid of Marilyn as soon as possible, then. That's Marilyn! She's Beldum's sister, another one of the three Shadow Sirens. See, now it doesn't make sense, because there's only two of them. <laughs> She'll attack you directly or use lightning. He also saves up energy for big attacks sometimes. So as long as you avoid the brunt of her attack, she shouldn't be too tough. Well, she's still got another turn left before, um... Yeah. Oh my god, I've done a lot of fucking damage. Are you okay, Marilyn? Super guard, bitch. More chance to attack her now available. Too bad she's almost fucking dead. We should do Supernova, actually. That's Beldum. He's the leader of the three Shadow Sirens. Back again. Her special move is a Blizzard Blast. If it hits you, you'll totally freeze. She has lots of other tricks up her sleeve, too. I wonder what that plan was that she mentioned. What do you think they're up to? Alright, we do not want Marilyn to attack, so we're going to be Sephiroth. Yeah! Repeatedly mash. Keep mashing. Got it. Boom. Boom. Yeah, curse you, Mario. This is so very annoying. Blast it. Super hard again. Oh no. Po Wait, she can poison you. I didn't know she could do that, actually. <laughs> Let's try Fire Drive out. Boom. Aw, oh, so close to killing her, too. Dang. Actually, no, wait, we're fine. Fire Drive again. Boom. Die, bitch. Now, that was an amazing boss fight. I've always really loved that boss fight. Uh, at this rate, she'll never. Uh. 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 Let's leave these doofuses, Mario. Let's leave these wimps, Mario. Let's leave these louts, Mario. Let's leave these wusses, Gonzales. I'm sorry, sis. Let's leave this cards, Mario. <laughs> Let's get cancer, Mario. <laughs> Let's leave these idiots, Mario. That's Bellum with the three Shadow Sirens, Mayor Vivian's sister. I'm totally surprised she followed us all the way out here, though. What was that plan she was yapping about, huh? That sounds bad. That's Marilyn. I still can't really get a good read on her, unfortunately. She didn't seem like a bad type, you ask me, but who knows for sure. That's Duplass, who I guess is one of the three Shadow Sirens now. Not a bad Franklin impersonator. 
Gosh, I have nothing bad sound to the real professor, frankly. And why is Duplass working with these two anyway? Too many questions. Bonk. I can't bonk them. It's too bad. Yeah, question. What happens when I come back? Oh, they're still there. I know at some point they leave. This music keeps getting better. Holy shit! We're inside the palace of shadow. This seems to be a corridor. I'm observing, huh? Listen, Mari. I know I said this before, but don't forget, you're not in this alone. You should rely on your partner's abilities. You never get stuck on anything. We got to save Princess Peach. I know you'll help her, Mario. And we'll all help you help her. We'll all help you help her. <laughs> That's a mouthful, isn't it? Bonk. I will gladly take this on the rage. Why is it so hard to get a first strike, man? That's a lot of wizards. Yeah. Wait, hang on. I want to see him split up. Ooh. But he's burned. Dumbass. Fuck you. I have no FP left. Sad. Oh, he, he also dropped a, um, in the rage. I have multiple of those. You know what? I could do- here's something funny I could do. <laughs> we can use double thunder rage. Boom, boom. Yeah, take that, ass wipes. Now it's really starting to sound like Origami King music. Oh boy, we have this puzzle coming up soon. The gears in the back of this room started moving when we unlocked the planetarium. Listen, Mario. We're gonna have to rely on everything we've learned to get through this. Just think about what we've been through, and I'm sure you'll find a way, okay? You need to hit a switch for dishes, let me, I wanna help. Eat. Oh, Bob, my old man, Bob, Bob, he's just way more helpful. Ooh. Help me. I have not seen the dodgy status yet, by the way. Yeet. So wait, does this count as its own room? No, it doesn't. How's the shadow concealed path, too? This is another corridor. I wonder how long these things go on. I'm sure it'll need all your special skills and those of your partners. Oh, yeah. That big block's living up to its name. Let's try the nearby hallway instead. I love that the Palace of Shadow is, like, animated. That's, like, fucking cool. How's the towel log looking, by the way? Wait a minute. There's an enemy missing in between the para... Spiky Parag- there's Spiky Gloomba and- what the fuck? That's weird. Hmm. How strange. Oh yeah, we got Dry Bones. A skeleton Koopa that sometimes builds friends. Even after it claps at zero HP, it'll sometimes get back up. It's the baddest of the bones bunch. So its HP is really high. When its HP gets down to zero, it might rise again. Anything new? Hey, at least the catalog is getting, you know, built out. 
HP sucking bat like thing. Its name comes from swooping blood sucking attack. <laughs> oh, that's like glad they kept Swooper and Swoopula the same. Can't wait for Swampire next. Or Swampire, as some stupid people say. <laughs> An angry spirit from beyond. Its flame attack will set you on fire. Whatever you don't use fire attacks. Dark boo. We got Bombshell Bill Blaster. Much tougher Bill Blaster. It's really strong, but if you don't beat it, it'll keep shooting Bombshell Bills. A souped up billet bi bullet bill. Billet bill? <laughs> it'll hit you hard if you don't take it out first. It's hey she's low, so do it quickly. A part machine, part organic magic using an entity. It'll multiply itself to confuse you. Oh, I just realized. Now, this is actually kind of cool. Now, there's exactly 100 normal enemies. Well, at least right here. Not really, because Bowser is in there somewhere. There's Gloomtail. Look how different he is. He's black and purple. Hooktail's brother. He's a big, dark, poison spinning baddie. Watch out for his famous Mega Breath attack. We also have Sack Duplus 2. Yeah, look how angry he is. A fiend who takes the shapes of Mario and his friends, then attacks. Recruited by Beldum, it is now the latest member of the Three Shadow Sirens. <laughs> hmm. Well, I'm confused then. Is Duplus an it or a he? Maybe it doesn't matter. Maybe I'm thinking too much on this. <laughs> Her magic is powerful, and she'll throw all sorts of magic powders at you. After Vivian left the trio, she pressured Duplis into filling the third spot. That's some nice lore there. After the three, the strongest of the three shadows. Watch out for her high attack power. She doesn't say much, but Bellum and Vivian can understand her just fine. So I think these three missing spots belong to the Shadow Queen, probably. Maybe. I mean, I think this is this is Grotus. There's some weird missing like entries. Okay, this is Grotus X, and I think this is Grotus himself. And then I guess the Shadow Queen gets three entries. I don't know. I'm kind of confused about what that's going to be like. Clear chapter 8 to unlock. Clear chapter 8 to unlock. I'll listen to this music at some point. I don't know when. So one thing I think that's really cool about this part of the Palace of Shadow is that it's actually just the, room, the rooms you were in before. But now they're like all mixed up and lowered and stuff. Oh. You gotta use Balberry for this, I guess. Alright, let's get Josh, our good old pal Josh out. Oh yeah, I think I remember what you gotta do here. Yeah, you gotta do that. And you gotta float on across, and yeah, not fall. You do not want to fall in that room. It's bad news, Betsy. Oops, wrong partner. We're inside Palace of Shadow, this is not a quarter, big surprise. Try looking up, you might just have our way forward. Ooh. Still at 5 HP, still carrying on. Still, um, hang on a thread here. We're inside the Palace of Shadow. The palace is all kind of... Place, place all about kooky puzzles, huh? You see those star marks in the middle of the corridor? They gotta be important. I wonder if there's anything over here. Oh, there's a phantom ember. I kind of do want to level up here. I'm 
Unfortunately, I'm out of uh, star power. Never mind. I got my star power back. Let's use Art Attack. Dirt, 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 dirt. There we go. All good. Fuck you, I leveled up! 60 BP. 60 is a nice big number. See, now that would be a really nice number to end on, honestly. End the game on, but we all know I'm gonna get more BP than that. If I'm not mistaken, I believe there's a. Uh... Oh god, hello. Hello, Dark Wizard. Ooh, I want that. Actually, how many items do I have, out of curiosity? I don't know, I hopefully have enough so I can steal this. Gotcha, bitch. Give me that, I want that. I want my life shrooms back. Actually, fire drive time. Ooh. All right, Miss Mouse, you get you get time to attack. Why is her stylish so weird in this game? Good question. I personally don't really know. Anyways, there's a chest over here with a shooting star. I remember that pretty well. Hey, though, that's great. Now we have, um... Now I have another life shroom, so I won't die as fast. I remember how to do this puzzle. Ooh. What's up, Chang Chong? You want to hit me real quick? Thank you. Oh, I fucked up. Okay, we're out of here then. Or maybe not. Whew. Hey, Gumbella back. I don't feel safe without... I don't feel safe without Rally Link, man. We got a locked door here. Hmm. Can you do the... Can you do the thing in this game? I don't think you can. Oh, nope. You cannot... You cannot do that. I mean, I might try it one more time. Or just jump down here. Yeah, you cannot, you cannot, um, you cannot jump up there with the paper mode anymore. That was a fun little sequence break in the original, though. I miss that ever so. Ooh, another block. At least they're constantly giving you items. Oh, another power punch. Oh yeah, I remember this little puzzle. Alright, so I'm trying to remember what that order was. Oh, 
Here's one random dark wizard to distract you from all your problems. Well, as long as you don't drop any hearts, I'll be fine. I remember the order! Yeah, check that shit out. Block work. Not sure how I remembered that. I actually wasn't paying attention to the order on the wall, I just kind of muscle memoried it. The gears in the back of this room started moving when we unlocked the planetarium. Listen, Mario, we're gonna have to rely on everything we know. The music just keeps getting more epic. Like, this is no doubt better than the original. Like, come on. Stop, you're interrupting the, the awesome music, dude. We're inside the Palace of Shadow Weep. Must be way underground by now. I'm totally running out of advice at this point, sorry. I have advisors block. Hey, don't worry, have faith in yourselves and your friends and we'll win. Bonk. Ooh, a point swap. Those are always nice. But I have too much space. I have enough power punches. What do I get ready? You know, I don't need the Ice Storm, to be honest. I need actually good healing items, do I have? Oh, I don't need the Ultra Shroom. We can get throw- we can toss that. Like, I have three genuine healing items. The Fire Pop, the Ink Pasta, and the Spicy Pasta, and that's it. Everything else I'm gonna have to rely on, like, Sweet Treat and stuff for. like this. God damn this music. Way too epic, man. I swear to God. The sealed path four. This is the last room. I want to see what, what the items are down here. Ooh, I want that. I want that. No, 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 no. You know what? Fuck it. Let's use a um, ice storm on these bad boys. We gotta use it somewhere. If I, I'll feel safe. I have two life shrooms. Mm mm. Alright, it's tremor time. I'm glad we get to be blasting this fucking music during battles. I don't miss the old music anymore. I've never turned so I've never turned around so hard on music before. One of the biggest glow-ups for a song, not gonna lie. I gotta tell Zach about this shit, holy crap.
And I have to go back to... I have to play Toho tomorrow after playing this absolute beauty of the game. <laughs> no offense to Toho, I guess. I need that life stream, man. I'm not going... I'm not... I'm not going... I'm not... I need it, dude. I'm not going without it. Need that. Yeah! I'm saving my boo sheets for Shadow Queen, probably. We're inside the Palace of Shadow. We must be way underground by now. Oh, this is the same room as that other one, huh? Oh boy. Hello, Chain Chomp. Perfect damage, wow. Oh, I'm not picking that up. Okay, I remember what you need to do here. You need to, um... Oh, almost picked up that heart by accident. And then really bad. Red Palace Key. Close. Come on, land on the block. No! You can't land on the lock anymore. What is this weird room? It's quiet. A little too... Well, let's just say it's quiet. There's a save block over there, and I'm thinking it'd be smart to use it. Flower. I mean, I have max items, so there better be something worth trading out. Nope. Yes. So they moved the Ultra Sherman Jam and Jelly down here now, I guess. That's what they did. Alright, buy Gradual Syrup. Tossing you. I wish I could use the Jam and Jelly right now. Or I wish I could use the Gradual Syrup right now. Pen speech probably just a little bit farther. Let's go, Mario. Alright, what badges do we want for this? Honestly, I'm not really feeling power bounce. Might go with something else. Like, um... You know what? I need to look up something. <laughs> Real quick. Mario Wiki, I need you for a sec. We're gonna look up something. Uh, Beast... If I, I need to look up Beastiary. They look up the Thousand Year Door Bestiary. Where is it? There it is. There's something I need to know. What is Grotus's status susceptibility rate? He's 30% to sleep. <laughs> this gives me a great idea then. We're gonna try and put the madman to sleep. Um, double that P wouldn't be too bad, honestly. Um. Could also go with uh, another flower saver, even though it's kind of boring. Quick change is nice, but not necessary. I might not. I might get rid of quick change. Actually, no. I might want it. Quick change might be nice to have, but I don't know. I'll see. I'll see. Cause I'm gonna tr probably just use Goombella the whole fight, so I can put on that extra power plus. And build it. E. I don't know. I don't know what other badges I want to put on. I'd have to take off something and put on a different badge. I could take off, um, hmm, put on Happy Flower and a Flower Saver. What Flower Saver? 
There we go, that should be good. Now I'll be set. I won't be using as much FP, so that's good enough for me. Ooh. Now this looks hella clean. Keepers, this room gives me a super bad feeling, Mario. What is this chamber? This must be the main hall or something. Sure is a humongous space. This must have been where the most important person in the place stayed. Palace stayed. But staying here makes me totally uneasy. Why is that? There's this dark, oppressive feeling coming from deep in the palace. Prince Peach might be up ahead. You can't even check. <laughs> we finally meet, Mario. I've been looking forward to this, I must admit. So this chump of the leader is the this this chump is the leader of those X knots? Yes, correct. I am the supreme leader of the secret society of X knots. I am Crotus. But I'm getting ahead of myself. I really must express my thanks to you first. And do you know why? You have gathered together all of the crystal stars I was seeking. No, so the last crystal star we found on the moon? What did we do? <laughs> You just realize now, do you? Yes. Instead of taking the few crystal stars you fools have fumbled into, it was far easier to let you find them all and open the thousand year door for me. How kind of you to bring them all here to me. All I had to do was entrust the last crystal star to my least competent underling. I don't suppose Crump had any idea of my plan, though. <laughs> so whether he beat you or lost to you, the Crystal Stars will be together in mine either way. Pure genius. Now, I thought the Shadow Sirens would do a little more to slow your progress. But it appears they are so useless that even this small task was beyond them. No matter, now I get the pleasure of sending you to Oblivion. Be careful, Mario. This jerk looks totally nasty. Once you fools are gone, no one will stand in my way. Grotus will rule the world. No way, we let that happen. Now come. Ooh. Meet your ends, you meddlesome fools. You'll know my power. My stream fucking eating shit again? Yes, it is. Stream is down. I repeat, stream is down. What the fuck is happening? This isn't good. Hold on. Okay, we seem to be back for now. I don't know why this keeps- I don't know why this is happening, bro. I gotta close some shit, maybe. <laughs> this is the second time I dropped frames this stream. Anyways, let's tattle him. That's a Grotus X. It protects Grotus. This guy is no problem on its own, but Grotus' defense goes up for each of them. When he has four surrounding him, we won't be able to damage him at all. Let's dish out some hurt to them while we pound on Grotus, got it? Alright, what do I have that I can deal with this? I do have a... I do have a... I do have one of those. 
Let's use Earth Tremor. Dude, this music's pretty great, too. Give Mario multiple turns. We might need to we need, might need to buff and use sweet treat. It's gonna be a tough battle. Actually, I just realized something. I'm gonna need to probably double dip. Shooting star, I'm, I might have to boost sheet this one. Or I could just heal. Yeah, I'm gonna boost sheet then. Burn the burn status. I haven't even tattled Grotus yet, that's the crazy part. I'm gonna fire drive this asshole. So I'm pretty sure if you do that, you get rid of his staff anyway. Alright, I'm gonna use a, um... I don't really have a lot of good FP healing, so... I got a better idea. Let's use... Just a sweet treat. Just a simple sweet treat. Oh, well, be nice if you didn't do that. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's okay, we're, we're fine. I'm gonna heal that status, and I'm gonna get my FP back. So you have the metal to push me this far, but no more. Oh, he's got the fucking counter status now. Yeah, that was, that's tough. I can finally tattle Grotus now. That's Grotus. He's the head of the Exynos who kidnapped Peach. But when he has Grotus X surrounding him, his defense will go up by that number. He may also use, electrify use electricity, fire, and time stopping magic. That doesn't sound good. Still, he's a totally weird guy. Why is he so intense and serious all the time? I guess we don't have time to be worrying about that. Let's beat him and find Peach. Yeah, I dropped a lot of frames this stream. It must have been- it must be because of the fact that my fucking brother installed Ethernet in his room or something. I blame that. Alright, what can we do here? Really should have brought in, uh, multi-bounce or something. I guess we'll Earth Tremor again. This is this fight's actually tough. I don't remember it being this tough in the original. 
I mean, I'm pretty sure it's the literally exact same fight as the original, though. I'm just making it harder for myself by doing a 10 HP run. Ooh, I got lucky. Alright. We're gonna have to probably rally wink this one. Mmm. Yeah, rally wink time. Alright, gonna act an additional turn. Can you still do the thing where you jump on his staff? Yeah, you can. You can jump on his staff still. All damage, okay. I need to get rid of, um... I need to get rid of those fucking Grotus X's though, seriously. Before they start causing problems. This should be good enough, though. Yes! He's got literally 8 HP left. Oh, you'll not stop me. Take this. Lucky again. Oh, he doesn't do the thing anymore where, like, his HP gets, like, or, like, his dome gets cracked or whatever. Alright, well, he's dead. Boom! Wow, wow, wow. Oh. Oh. oh my god, Merle coming in with the clutch! Merle, let's go! 64 star points! That's like that's enough to load me up. I get a level up after all. Okay, we're definitely going FP then. Yeah, we got it. We got to go FP. I keep running out of FP. That's such a big problem. Oh, you are more than you seem. But this is not finished. I saw even this possibility. Huh? Watch this. Ooh, epic music time. Where am I? Mario! Princess Peach! Move one step and she'll breathe no more. It wouldn't. Now try this. Oh! <laughs> now again. Oh! Mario. What do we do, Mario? We're totally done if we don't attack him. Let's attack! Worm, you dare defy me? Do you not care for the life of your pitiful princess? Very well then. Oh good, they fixed they fixed the uh, Grotus bug. <laughs> Where his dialogue tree was, like, reversed. Very well, then. What? Oh. Oh. 
Bowser. Ugh, that was a surprise. I didn't think I'd fall. From an ancient tower construction. Your impactfulness. Are you okay? Ugh, why is Mario here? And Peach as well. I don't know what's going on here, but I'm going to put an end to it right now. Mario, first I pound you, then I take the princess, and then the crystal stars. What? This is totally unfair. All this and Bowser too? Haha, <laughs> a worn out from your battle, Mario. Yes, easy pickings. Today's the day I flush a plumber down the drain. Yeah. <laughs> What's a finale without a Bowser appearance, huh? Pretty finale, that's what. Now hold still while I trans you and take Peach. Mario, you sniveling bug? This is it for you. <laughs> yeah, I'm turning this shit up. This fucking song goes hard as well. That's Bowser, genius. You've only fought this guy like a bazillion times. He'll keep kidnapping Peach and you'll keep fighting him until the end of time, I think. Damn, listen to this guitar shredding. In addition to his fire breath, he jumps on you and bites. If you get jumped on, you'll be unable to use a command for a little while. When his bite sometimes poison you as well. I don't know what Bowser's doing here, but we gotta defeat him quick. Alright, question. Can I put Cammy to sleep? Yeah! Let's go. Sleepy. Five turns, too. Oh my god, Peril Strats. <laughs> I sure do feel good today. I'm feeling it. Lord Bowser, Lord Bowser! Remember, let's get them! No way, he should fucking recover from her status from that? That's fucking crazy. That's Cami Koopa. She's an evil old witch who's always helping Bowser out. She uses magic to raise her attack and defense or get electrified or invisible. When her HP gets low, she may also use magic to restore HP. Her magic is totally annoying, so take her out before you focus on Bowser. Still, you got a little feel for her having to hang out with Bowser all the time. Or do you think Bowser has a harder time enduring her? Alright, well, I'm definitely using a boo sheet here. I'm actually almost out of boo sheets. Oh, shit. Oh, crap. Put them to good use, then. Alright, power punch time. There's the bite. Yeah! Happy flower kicking in! Let's sleepy stomp. Oh, she's fucking dead. Forgive me, Lord Bowser. I have nothing left. All right, let's see if I can sleep Bowser too. Oh, Bowser's asleep. We're gonna end this battle right now, then. Spin jump. Yeah. This is gonna be an easy fight, I think. Alright. Let's end it with a fire drive. Boom! Oh. 
Yes. Oh yeah. I dropped eight thousand frames. That's fucking crazy. How could this happen? Yeah, that was Harry. At least we settled that, dweebs, lahash. Now let's save Peach, okay, Mario? Hmm. What? Where's Crotus? Oh! That was Peach. Ooh, spooky.